energy is one of those ones which you want to explain to the pupils, but sometimes it's difficult to do so because it's something that they can't physically see. Friction is one of these phenomena where teachers usually tend to neglect them. You just tend to say that, okay, this uh, kinetic energy turned into thermal energy. But with an infrared camera, you can actually see that increased temperature. My name is Jesper. Uh, I'm a researcher in physics uh, at Uppsala University. Wow, what? <laughs> it's very warm here. For the last couple of years, we've been developing and testing out different uh, laboratory exercises for uh, schools with thermal cameras. You predict something before, you observe with the uh, infrared camera, and then you explain what, what you've seen. We have found that uh, thermal cameras are very good at uh, introducing concepts such as heat conduction and insulation. Today was the, actually the first time that I've used the thermal cameras and I was very impressed by them. All of the models are very easy to use. Dark is very good because it's very cold. Now what's happening as Zaki rubs it against the table? It gets blue on the table. And can you see that clearly with the thermal camera? Yeah. Very good. Because of the thermal cameras, you now have the opportunity to show them, because of the different colours, where there is more heat and less heat. How will the hands feel? How do they feel? Warmer. Warm. Warmer. Warmer. Very good. Why? Warm. Because of the friction. Yeah. friction. Very good. What does it say next? What will it look like with the infrared camera? So before you look at it, what do you think it will look it like? Will get more. What um, colours will be on the red, camera? Red or white. Red or white. Yeah. white. So to tell them what it looks like to you when you see it. Red and white. <laughs> and then red again. Your face is so red. <laughs> at the university level, uh, infrared cameras are very good at um, complementing traditional laboratory exercises. Uh, my experience is that uh, students of all ages find this um, technology very easy to use and they pick it up within seconds.